So I wanted to show you both. See all these plants here that we replanted? Yeah. I'm going to show you the difference of pots and then what they look like the when day. we get them in the ground. But we should have squash soon. Yeah. So, or bigger pots makes a difference. But so if you look at the these plants, they're the same mm -hmm. ones over there and I've just been watering them a lot better. So they're doing a heck of a lot better than the ones up there in the pots. There's all our cucumbers, so it's coming along. So at the end of every video, you guys will see me time-lapse doing more in the garden um, at the end of every video. But look at these tomato plants, they're getting big. And then the ones that don't have things, uh, mulch on them yet and everything, they, they're not doing as good because they dry up quicker. But look at the lettuce is all bolting. So we're going to go off to work. Good morning, good boss. Good morning. How are you? Good, good. Starting the day off right mm -hmm. with coffee. Oh, yeah. Coffee and still dry. We're going on. This is number 18. Day 18 without rain. Mm -hmm. So you'll hear me say that every day until we get rain. So <sighs> this is usually feast a... Feast or famine. Feast or famine. Yeah, this is usually a weekly account, but it's 11 days now because it really hasn't grown much. So we already started shifting our entire schedule um, and pushing out. Mm -hmm. And we are going to fill tomorrow in with two mows and some landscaping. Uh, two mulch jobs, right? At the, yeah, right two next to each other. they're right next to each other. So I think it's a total of like 12 yards. So I'll record that, but that's what we do when we get dry. We throw that in. Mm -hmm. I'm not worried yet. We have a planting project to throw into, but we don't really want to do that right now with it being dry. so, so dry. And um, we are going to hit 91 again today. Yeah. So, so that's so that's what we do. I, like I said, I'm I'll start getting worried in another week if we don't have any rain. Yeah, you just go with the flow. I mean, as a business, you have to be prepared for dramatic changes like this. Anything can happen. So my numbers are: I'd like to hit 200 mows a month, mm -hmm. and that makes me comfortable. Uh, we're going to be a little over 200 this month for May. We'll see for June. If we don't get no rain, we're definitely not going to be near that. Yeah. But the boss will put me to work somewhere else. So yeah, we'll figure something out. And I think I need to shave, boss. Yeah, I think you do too. You guys want me to grow a beard? Yeah, you want to join the beard crew? No, you'll see it gone though by the time you see this video. It'll be gone. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's get to work. First two of the day, we're going to go this way with it. We're both gonna go this way with it, so maybe I'll set you guys up here to watch me.
that's two done. Look how dry this one is. We'll put this one on 10 days next, even though we did 11. I'm hoping for rain within that 10 days. So if not, I'll get moved for two weeks. Off to the next one. I don't feel like going out there to work, boss. Do I have to go to work? Yeah. The sun went away for no, a minute. No, it's back. Now it came back. It's more humid than yesterday, so yeah. even though it's only like 83, it feels like almost 87, 88. Yeah. And I think we're supposed to actually hit 90, 91 today. So we're taking it easy, right? Yeah, it's a little bit better this time. Yeah, you it's not are, as long. I'm used to seeing it at 14 days and it being ridiculous. Well, today's only 12 days. That's the big difference on mm -hmm. like what a difference it is. Yeah. So, so I'll get you a before, see if the boss can stripe it. She's going to make it a little bit lower. Mm -hmm. right? I'm going to try to take it a little bit lower. So. This is a warm season grass, so technically I should be taking it down to like three and a half, but can't go that way. Oh, I thought yet. you cut warm season grass at like half inch. Even lower than three and a half? I think you cut it at like a quarter inch. Oh, uh, well, I think that there's fescue and yeah, stuff. I'm, I'm just out. messing with you, boss. Oh, okay, let's okay. get to work before let's see what the boss does which way she goes she'll surprise me because i gotta go mow the front and the gate she's making me push mow i don't know how that happened how did what? i go from mowing this before all the time and you push mow now i have to push mow because you're weedy really yeah. okay and i'm fast you're fast three okay. done man the lawns are starting to look horrible starting to look horrible and i don't think we're supposed to get rain there ain't even a above 40 percent chance of rain for like the next 10 12 days so we'll see how that turns out but let's get this done i'm petering here i know i'm only on number five four and five and i'm hot it is hot today very humid and dry so i wish that the sky would just open up but that ain't gonna happen for at least another eight days <laughs> not eight nine or ten days i've seen there's a 20 30 percent chance of rain so, at least it's going to get cooler. Yeah. So we finished them two over there. I wanted to show you the stripes, but I forgot to. She did pretty good stripes for how dry it was. So, boss, I was thinking I'm going to do a question for the day. Okay. The question is, and we'll answer this. You'll see us mow some, and then we'll give you our answer. What is worse? Rain, 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 rain? Or a drought, drought, drought. You guys tell me, what would you prefer? And we'll tell you what we'd prefer. Yeah. six and seven, and I gotta leave this over here with the boss. Stripes in this. So Rachel's finishing that one, these two. She mowed this one. Looks good for being dry, but it grew. So that was number six, seven, and eight. We're off to nine and ten. I'm not sure how many I'm gonna be able to do today. I have no idea. But we'll see. So Rachel, we're on number nine and number ten. Yes. Not very motivated. No, no, I've lost my motivation about four yards ago. Um, it's, 88 degrees, but... Yeah, it's pretty hot out here. I mean, I know it's hotter in Florida. Dry. I know, but we're not used to hot weather this early and dry this early. And we're not actually used to 90s at all. No. Because we barely ever get 90s here. No. Even though we're in the south, but we're up in the mountains. Yeah. So we're going to, and it's crazy because this lawn's been 13 days and we've had no rain for 18 days now or 17, I think 18. And it's long. It grew. It grew. It's and not, the lawns aren't thick anymore though. No, they're thin and then the weeds yeah. are taken over. And once we don't fertilize. But mm -hmm. after this mow, we'll put it back on nine, 10 days again. And I'm pretty sure if there's no rain, we'll move it. Yeah. But it'll still grow. It probably will slow down a lot after this cut. 
Yeah. So. You can see everything's patchy. Oh, yeah. So. You should wish for the rain. All right. Well, I was doing the rain dance. I was trying. Yeah. Well, it ain't working. You're not dancing hard enough. I guess not. Okay. I got to push mow some of this. The boss has got to push mow some of this. And then I got to weed eat all of it. So. Mm -hmm. yeah. well, that's good. So here's number nine and ten. And even without rain, they still grew some. But they ain't going to grow after we cut it this time. So I do that one over there. We got to push mow all this and then push mow the back and she cuts a little bit in the back but let me get this done so these two are done off to the next two yeah Very watch how you don't get poison i know hopefully there is no poison there what is all this stuff i don't know People pile it up in the Debris. township, supposed to take it, and they don't. So we're climbing through the woods here, trees to come out to this lawn here. We're gonna mow this one here, and I'm gonna prune like two or three bushes, not every bush. Yeah. 6.51. And actually we have been done. We just um, stopped at the store and all that good stuff. So I guess we should answer their question, right? Or our, yeah, question. our question. So you guys answer it too. What would you prefer, a drought or tons and tons of rain like some people up north are getting and like Acme mowing and Oklahoma's getting yeah out. people are dealing with tornadoes and stuff we're thinking about you for sure I will say hands down I would rather have the flooding yeah I you know I was complaining so much about all the rain and like how it just needed to give a little bit and now I'm good I'm sorry Billy Goat. I'm gonna do it I'm gonna do it Billy Goat. I'm gonna do the rain dance and I'm gonna get the kids involved <laughs> And we're going to hope that um, this drought does not stay around because it's not good. Yeah, I but it, when, <sighs> when it's rain, 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 at least when it breaks, you can, um, you know, do prunings and mulching. You can and and get caught up on some mowing. When there's a drought like we got 18 days, I mm -hmm. think we'll be able to get a few more, another week of mowing probably. But if we don't see rain there's no mowing for we're going to be on 14 to 24 day schedule we're already pushing clients back so and there's nothing you can if you're all if you're all lawn care like we're we have a lot of projects that we can catch up on and yeah do. which projects meaning like mulching mulch projects um yeah. because honestly you want to be careful about doing any heavy pruning especially in these conditions yeah when it's hot and dry out like, like this, we so. have only put down half of our apps as far as our second round of fertilizer because you can't put it down it'll degrade yeah without any rain and nobody waters around here so no, we know how you're so feeling it uh mo i think it's pretty much all of north carolina now mm -hmm. um we haven't had rain in like 18 days tomorrow will be 19 so i'd rather have the rain guys i know we all complain about weather in our different ways but i hands down rather have rain yeah it's tough out there just stay motivated we'll get through this you know whatever you guys are dealing with that's what this community is for right yeah so we'll get it done yeah so please like comment and subscribe and remember be happy whether you're flooded drought yeah you have to try you have to try have we, a good night we've been uh -huh. in this we've been in this for 10 years now and we've seen it all so what? Yes. you haven't seen it all Say be happy. Be happy. <laughs> Have a good night. Okay, guys. So I'm back out here again. It's like 8:30. We're gonna see if we can get this row, this row, and this row covered with mulch from the truck because I need the truck for mulch tomorrow. So I'll put you on a time lapse.